What's getting on me fam? I'm Ad. I'm Terry. And welcome to a new reaction video. What do we have today? We have Emmy Way tribute to Eminem. Yes, so this has been requested heavily. Um, we've done quite a lot of Emmy Way by now. Yeah. Um, we reacted to Emmy Way versus Raftar. That was our first introduction to him. And um, he was sick, man. So much he like. Yeah, he, oh. was, he was sick, like I think. He just got charisma when he's on the screen. For sure. And I think that's what we both really appreciate about him. Mm. I think someone's already mentioned that Emmy Way, the name is taken almost like kind of out of like the Eminem kind of thing, okay. like the EMI kind of thing. So that he obviously really likes like him. him yeah. Um. So this will be interesting, man. Like I'm expecting a fire. It's going to be interesting as well because he's not going to be dissing anyone. At least <laughs> I think so. So it's kind of interesting to just see yeah. what it's going to sound yeah, like. Of delve and dig into his art artistry a bit yeah. more and yeah yeah excited yeah. for this one so let's get into Jump it in. starting with i lose yourself it's interesting because he's got he's mir he's mimicking the eight mile scene mm -hmm. with the hoodie and the kind of setting This is different, different side of him. Cool man, I think I didn't really know what to expect. I didn't realize he was gonna be rapping over the lose yourself beat, so that was like a nice kind of you know, what I mean, just like a bit of a oh. surprise. Um, what were your what were your first, first thoughts? So, I just want to go back to the diss track. So, no, <laughs> yeah, yeah, just because from the diss tracks, I could tell he was talented, yeah, and it was a more braggadocious kind of anyway, yeah, 
this one, he flipped the script. Yeah. And is super introspective. And what I love about it, he didn't just copy Eminem's yeah. style. Yeah. He brought his own towards yeah, the yeah, latter yeah. half of the song. Yeah, for sure. And it felt real. It felt he he made it like I felt like I was listening to something of Eight Mile. Yeah, like. yeah. I think for me, what was interesting was hearing more about him as a person and his journey to where he is now. Mm. Um, I thought it was like interesting hearing just like how he didn't know what rap was until he was X Y Z. Like mm. can't remember the exact age, but kind of hearing those kind of stories and like even the thing with his dad saying don't rap in English, like. Mm. Maybe that's what he started trying to do initially, like thinking that that's his only way to make it. Yeah. Obviously, you know, that's completely understandable. If all of the popular rappers are rapping in English, yeah, yeah. you're going to want to do the same thing. Um, so uh, yeah. kind of seeing that switch and then... But I feel like, I feel like there was something in what his dad said and almost just like, look, if you can't take over or rule what's around yeah. you, or you know where you are, like how are you trying to go and yeah, yeah, go yeah. out there. And... Yeah, so it's, I think it's great. It, it was good advice that he got yeah. probably, and I think that's what I kind of enjoyed about the song more than just the the flows were great, the lyrics mm. were great, but it was more what he was talking about. Because you I'm, know, yeah. Because in the last couple of tracks, we were just like. We were, like it was cool hearing what he was saying, yeah. but it was more like his energy on screen and yeah. his delivery and his yeah. whole that whole kind of package mm. whereas with this one it was more like that stuff is cool he can still do that yeah. and that came out in flashes with this which you know are some of the best moments of the tracks mm. i think that's when he's really at his best when his personality is coming through but what was nice was hearing more about his story and mm. kind of where he's been and where he's got, kind of yeah got, got to the tribute the name tribute to eminem yeah i i get it yeah but i I felt like it was more than that mm. because he was given his personal story. Yeah. So I can understand that Eminem was a big part of that. So I can understand yeah. that element. But I do feel like the title. Yeah. Um, it could. It didn't need to be that. Maybe. I wouldn't say it didn't need to because it's personal. Yeah. Thing, but yeah. for me, I wouldn't have said it needed to be because. Yeah, yeah. It could have just stood alone. Yeah, yeah, it could have stood alone. It was that good that yeah. he didn't need, obviously, but obviously he used the Eminem beat. So, yeah. fair enough. But fair enough. Yeah. I think it's nice now that we can, we know this guy, we like this guy, yeah. but now we can dig into his catalogue and what he's got and what he's going to continue to release. And, and he, yeah, even the bravery to go over a classic, you don't go over True. a beat like that and yeah. mess it up. Yeah, and, yeah. You know, there's some beats, do you want to touch yeah, and man. to do that? It's brave, but you know he's a brave guy. I think we know that already. <laughs> but yeah, he's um, a straight up assassin. Yeah, man, he's sick. But yeah, I think we both really like him. Yeah. Um, for new subscribers, I'm a rapper producer. I'm a director, screenwriter. So that's why we look at this shit a little bit differently. Yeah. I thought video wise, it was really it was good because it had a bit of a throwback to the lose yourself video. Some mm. of the shots like that, when he's like his head coming to the camera, like just popping very reminiscent of what Em was doing in Lose Yourself video and obviously that first scene when he's with that hoodie. Mm. So there were nice callbacks in, in that aspect. But yeah, um, I think we both enjoyed this. Um, if you haven't heard any of our music yet, make sure you go check that out. Make sure you're watching every video. We're dropping a new music video every single week. Um, it's crazy and we're gonna continue doing that till the end of the year. I think we've just dropped our eighth video yeah mad so make sure you go check that out you're gonna want to check it out especially fans of this kind of music <laughs> um the song's called why and it's you know talking about things like colorism in bollywood and just all of this crazy mm. shit so make sure you go check that out if you want to fire a fire b stick location and good bars come to the right place fire. um but yeah man Thank you for watching. Keep it with us in the comments. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Hit the notification icon. And yeah, until next time. See ya.